Ladies and gentlemen, Direct Cell Nation presents Chantel Schultz. Get the latest information on direct sale companies, products, business building strategies, and opportunities. We support the guys and gals next door because we are the guys and gals next door. Join us at directcellnation.com to find and list a business and sign up for our newsletter. And now your host, Chantel Schultz. back for our second part of the interview with Miss Sandy Kreps and she's an independent Cincy consultant. Can you go ahead and tell us a little bit about yourself? I sure can. <laughs> um, I have been with Cincy for about three years. Um, originally I discovered it because my friend asked me to host a party. Didn't really know what it was but um, I love the product. Um, I love that there was a safer alternative to candles because at the time I had a toddler and I thought what a great way because I, I haven't been using my candles. What a great way to scent my house. Um, and I decided to sign up a couple months later because all my friends were ordering and I thought maybe they should order from me <laughs> and uh, just really been enjoying it. Also, I'm a mom now of two kids and after my second baby, I quit my full-time job and really focused more on Scentsy. So now I work Scentsy and work only part-time and I think that's, <laughs> that's the highlights <laughs> anyway. Okay. Well, can you give us a quick description of the products that Scentsy offers? I sure can. Um, our original product is a wickless candle. It's basically two pieces. There's your warmer, which is uh, a light bulb, or the newer ones have a little heating element like a hot plate, um, and wax. Um, and instead of a candle, you break off a bar of this wax, put it in the warmer, and it will make your house smell good. And they come in a variety of sizes. And now we have a lot of other scented products too. We've got um, room sprays, hand creams, travel items, scentsy buddies. Um, <laughs> All kinds of things that smell good. That's what we're all about. <laughs> awesome. Okay, well, a lot of direct sales companies talk about your why. Can you tell us a little bit about your why? Um, my why really is is my kids um, and and wanting to do what I want to do. I was at a full-time job that um, my, my boss really didn't like me. <laughs> she was kind of mean. And I was spending a lot of time in my car, you know, driving to this job to basically be bullied and when I was expecting my daughter I thought I don't need to do this anymore I've got this business um, if I could work my business a little harder then you know I could probably um, I, I could leave this job and I did committed to do that I told my husband I'll pay for the car and he said if you can really pay for the car make the car note then you can quit and I went okay <laughs> and so um, I committed to do that, and then I now have a part-time job and work Cincy, and it's it's really great. I can be here for my kids three days a week and still get out and get my girl time um, mm -hmm. doing Cincy parties, so it really is a good balance. <laughs> great. Well, can you tell us about the business opportunity that Cincy offers and how someone can find out more or get involved? Absolutely. So it, to join Cincy, it's pretty simple. You would visit my website, um, sandysellscents.cincy.us slash join. And there are FAQs, there are a lot of information, um, but you just follow the prompts and sign up and you get a starter kit. It's $99 uh, plus tax and shipping, so that will vary a little bit depending on where you are. Um, and you will get everything you need to get started and demonstrate for parties. You'll get party testers. Um, I have the mini size here. It's basically, it's like this, so people can smell. You'll get the bigger size, which are about three times as much. Um, you get a warmer, you get a bar, you get a whole set of products so you can show people this is Scentsy <laughs> um, and catalogs and business supplies and you also get training from the company, you get support from me. <laughs> I will tell you here's what to do to get started and get going and really if you're addicted to Scentsy you might as well sign up. <laughs> Minimum is only 150 every three months and if, if you love it like I love it you could buy that for yourself and on gifts anyway. Oh yes, definitely. <laughs> Well, and um, can you talk about, uh, is there any other type of incentives besides just the typical compensation plan? Yes. Right now we are actually in our incentive trip earning period for a free trip to Cancun. And the cool thing is if you sign up for Scentsy tomorrow, you can still earn this trip. So you, if you want to travel, <laughs> um, Scentsy is a great company. There will be a fall too. We don't know where yet. Um, but my director just got back from Greece. We have some really great opportunities to earn trips through some compensation. Build the team, your team, 
There's a lot of ways that's going to come to your family. Yeah. <laughs> awesome. Well, is the business opportunity available available to people who live outside of the U.S.? And if so, what countries? It is available in the U.S., Canada, Mexico, Australia, the U.K., Germany, and I think we're adding more. Australia, I think. <laughs> I said Australia. Okay. <laughs> and if you're not sure about your country, you can just get in touch with me and I'll let you know because we are adding more countries all the time. So if you happen to find this video in two years, mm -hmm. <laughs> your country may have been added. Exactly. So <laughs> touch with me and I will find out for you. Awesome. So what has been your biggest hurdle in growing your Cincy business and how have you worked to overcome it? Um, I think a hurdle that I faced was I had hosted not too long before I joined and then I did my launch party and then I thought, okay, I'm out of friends and family. They've all bought something. They've all been to my party. What do I do? And there was an incentive trip going on at that time in the summer to earn, um, special warmers that you, you had to be a consultant to earn them. You, there was no other way to get them. And there was product credit for grabs and I, and I want the, um, and I got a lot of no's. I got a lot of um, this did, and I thought, this is great. You are in real or to stage a home that maybe smells like pets or old carpet or something. Um, so I came to that office and sold to their agents, got invited to another office manager, sold to their agents, and eventually got a new team member from building a relationship with that company. So it was worth it, even though it took, it took a lot of rejection. <laughs> <laughs> Good deal. Okay, so uh, can you tell us about a time you stepped out of your comfort zone to grow your business, and how did that turn out? Yeah, well, that was one. <laughs> mm -hmm. um, and there, there have been a lot. Um, I've, I do small vendor fairs a lot if, if an event comes up, and sometimes I don't really want to go by myself. So if there's Eddie, shh, excuse me, my son is home. <laughs> Um, if there is an event that doesn't have a Cincy vendor and I'm free and I can afford the table, I think, okay, let's do it. And I don't really know what I'm getting into, but I'm going to go and I'm going to meet new people and it's going to be fun. And with recruiting, um, you know, if it's somebody you don't know well, the first couple times you approach people and say, I have a business opportunity for you, you feel a little bit crazy until you realize that it is a blessing for them. If it's a blessing for me, it's a blessing for someone else. And so... Um, that was uncomfortable for me the first few times, but um, now I really love being able to offer people the business, um, and it, it's good. I'm growing. <laughs> <laughs> good. So what's the craziest thing you've done to grow your business? The craziest thing? Um, I don't know. Maybe it was that real estate thing. <laughs> probably, um, just, just sort of making people take basket parties, too. Um, in addition to a home party, you can have a basket party, which um, here's one example. So I've got this little bag, and it has um, testers in it and business cards and pins. And it has usually, but I just got it back today, so they're out. Um, <laughs> but I meet with somebody for coffee, and, and they smell this. And I say, well, just take it. You're going to get some free. <laughs> they say, what? I say, take the bag. <laughs> I put four order forms in there go. Um, and some of those people end up joining my team too because they've collected orders and it was so easy. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so it's a little crazy. I kind of, I, I meet people anywhere. I've met people like kid. I brought my daughter to booths and shows when she was really tiny. I think one time I was breastfeeding her while I was taking orders. So that was kind of crazy. <laughs> <laughs> the party had been going on a while and the host is like, I don't care. So <laughs> do what you got to well, do. <laughs> Oh, no, you got to make it work. It's a family business. <laughs> yes, definitely. <laughs> so what's been the most effective strategy you've used to build your business? Really just sharing it with everyone and, and being consistent. Um, showing people that I'm excited about Cincy. Um, I want to tell you about it. I want you to come over and enjoy it. If you don't have a warmer, I will loan you one. You can take it to your house and try it out yourself. Or come to my house and smell what I've got. Um, just and being generous, you know. Here, take a bar, take a warmer. Um, it's we also have three brands for some people who don't know. And so with Cincy, we're able to recruit people with different interests. So I can pick up somebody who is into fashion to sell our fashion line, or somebody who's into food to sell our our kitchen stuff with our two different brands. And then 
uh, really build a team of diverse people. So we have a lot of opportunities um, in that regard. Great. Great. So overall, what would you say are the greatest benefits to being a part of your company and the direct sale community in general? Um, I think the community in general is um, is really wonderful because you can you can choose your destiny really. You can decide how much you want to work. Do you want to work at home? Do you want to do your business online? Do you want to do your business in a home party setting? What? How do you want to do it? Um, and it, it gives people the opportunity to inspire others and earn. Um, income based on your your work and how much you help other people, and that is really cool. And that's industry wide, and the products are great. Everything I've ordered from a, another direct seller, I've really thought was good quality. Um, what I think is special about Cincy Family is the opportunity to recruit in different brands, like I mentioned, um, and we also have just a really great company. I, I feel like the owners really care about us. Um, I feel like my team is so supportive. We have great training. Um, both from our team and from the from the home office from the company, and they really do listen. That we have a place where we can submit ideas, or you can call them, and if if you have a suggestion, it's not surprising six months later to see that they've changed it. You know, like let's fix this on our website, or let's introduce this product. They really do listen to the consultants, and and it's a product people love and people want. So you can't beat that. <laughs> I agree. <laughs> All right, well, what would you say to someone who's considering joining a direct sale company but hasn't taken the plunge yet for whatever reason? Um, I think the, the first thing, which I never thought about because I didn't really research, uh, is that you can research your company and you can research your sponsor. So interview some people. You know, If you're really seriously considering this, don't be afraid to call some potential sponsors and ask them questions, um, kind of like what I'm being asked <laughs> to say, you know, how do you train people? What's, how does your average consultant get started? Um, why do you do this business? Um, you know, don't, don't be afraid to do that. Um, and really just make sure that you're passionate about the product and you love the product. If you don't love it and you're not going to use it, you won't be able to sell it. I mean, why Why would you have somebody using something that you don't use? And it, you know, So if you don't love it, move on to the company that you do love and really find that thing that you are so passionate about that you think everybody should have one. Mm-hmm. <laughs> and then sign up and use it and love it and share it. Oh, yes. Okay, well, is um, oh, what's your favorite business book? Um, I really like Secrets of Closing the Sale by Zig Ziglar. I also enjoy Failing Forward by John Maxwell. Mm -hmm. And I've read a couple by Mary Christensen, and those are, um, those are really cool too. Good. And your favorite book for fun? Um, book for fun. I enjoyed, recently I finished the Hunger Games trilogy, so that was, um, that was good. I like the movies too. Mm -hmm. And I liked Harry Potter, um, Stardust is a really cute book and movie if you haven't read or I seen it. I saw the movie, but I haven't seen the book yet. Or the read book the book is good. Yet. It's very <laughs> similar to the movie. Um, <laughs> I don't have a new favorite fun book right now. I've been uh, busy working and working my other job. <laughs> so <laughs> I haven't had a lot of time to read, but hopefully I'll find another one. Oh, awesome. Okay. Well, would you? is there anything else that you'd like to say about the business opportunity or Cincy family? Um. I, just, I think everyone should come be a part of Cincy family. Oh, yes. we got something for everyone over here. <laughs> right? Um, we, we really do need more consultants. I mean, people people think, oh, Cincy, I've heard of that. It's saturated. Um, you know, because Cincy's been around for 10 years, people think that we don't need consultants. But um, that's just really not true. I think we have, um, I want to say it's around 200,000 active consultants right now. And I live near Houston, which has 5 million people. Mm-hmm. So if you look at that ratio... Um, it's really not a lot. 2,000 consultants in the whole world and 5 million in my city. It's like, yeah, we need people. I meet people every time I do a show who have never heard of Cincy and never used it. Um, and that's business that's out there that could be for me or it could be for you. It can be for anyone. So right. we do need more consultants. We do have a demand for this product. And, you know, it's an established company. You can get in and know people love the product. And, and that makes it that much easier for you to be able to build your business. And your business can be like an international business, you know, like a worldwide, like global business, yes. you know. If you have friends in the UK or Australia or Germany or Mexico or Canada, mm-hmm. uh, they can be on your team as well as people in the United States or, or whatever, whatever country you're in, you can recruit um, internationally. So um, that's a really cool opportunity too that, I mean, I would love to have a team all over the world and I can write off my vacation to Germany to go <laughs> create my team, you know. So if you're in Germany. <laughs> yeah. Sign um, up with me. <laughs> I love Schwarzen Castle, so go ahead and join Cincy with me. How funny. <laughs> <Put it> together. <laughs> That's awesome. Um, 
Oh, I was going to say something. Yeah. Well, yeah, I hadn't even heard of Scentsy either. And then, um, actually, I thought it was like one of those, like, uh, like a fun party type of deal, you know? Because oh, I was like, oh, it's sensual, like scentsy. Yeah. No, it's scent like smell. <laughs> but it was so much better. <laughs> yeah. That's a little different. But I like that because, you know, it's a product that appeals to everyone. Yes. Um, we have things for men. We have things for women. We have things for children. Um, like I said, you can bring your baby to your party. It's not like you have to tell people, oh my gosh, don't come if you're under 18, you know? Um, or don't come if you're a man. There's nothing here for you. I mean, there really is something for everyone. I do have male customers. Um, I do have teenagers who buy from me out and about at vendor fairs. Um, the kids, kids love, my kids pick the scents for our house and love the buddies. So um, it appeals to all ages, any gender, um, anybody. Scent triggers memories for people and people smell it and you can, you can just watch them. You watch their expression and they say, oh, this reminds me of my grandma. This reminds me of summer camp. This reminds me of the garden. You know, it's, it's so cool to connect with people on that level and, and watch them remember because of scent. Yes. <laughs> yes. I agree. And about the guy thing, I mean, like there's a lot of men that are like, you know, they try to be all manly about it, but they're like, I really like this one. <laughs> Sometimes they blame it on their wife. Um, yeah. <laughs> you know what? Men are more picky. Oh, I do have several customers who are male and Sometimes the wife bought it initially and brought it into the home, mm -hmm. but the husband or the boyfriend are, usually calls me for the refill because the men are picky, <laughs> and they only want, you know, the five cents that they like, and they don't want their wife messing it up and ordering the wrong thing, so it really is funny, uh, <laughs> and get so picky about their cents. It's, it's hilarious, and we have men who are consultants, too, and they do great, and... I bet, I bet. <laughs> Man wouldn't love a job where he gets to have parties and it's, you know, 80% women show up and he just gets to hang out with women and laugh and build a business and his wife can host and he can host and it's, it's fun. <laughs> <laughs> awesome. All right. Well, is there anything else you'd like to say or do you just want to remind everybody how they can get in touch with you? Yeah, you can find me online. Um, my Scentsy website is sandysellsense.scentsy.us. Or I'm on Facebook. It's facebook.com slash Sandy Sells Sense. And I'm on Gmail at the same, Sandy Sells Sense <laughs> at gmail.com. I was consistent at least. Uh, <laughs> you can also call or text me, 409-504-4840. Um, I do work part-time and I have two kids, so don't be offended when I don't answer. It's not about you. <laughs> I will call back. Um, but I just, I, I love this business and I love sharing it. And so if you're curious about fragrance products, I would love to send you a sample. Um, if you are curious about hosting a party, we can do that on Facebook or we can do that online or we can do it in person. And if you say, you know what, I want the whole enchilada, I want to get some money and I want to go on that trip to Cancun, um, I would love to help you get that goal as well. So whatever you need, get hold of me and I would love to help that ha help you make that happen. <laughs> Awesome. Well, thanks again for being here. I enjoyed hearing everything that Cincy has to offer. <laughs> thanks for having me. All right. Thanks for listening, and we look forward to meeting you at directcellnation.com, where we support the guys and gals next door. Be sure to tune in next time for more great information from Direct Cell Nation and Chantel Schultz. Please be aware that these interviews are conducted with independent representatives and are not official spokespersons for their respective companies. For more information about a specific company, please visit their website.